Grain flow is a term you will hear throughout the forging industry. But what is it? And why is it so important? In this video, we'll explain the basics. All raw materials are processed at a mill or foundry, turning them into certified and usable bars or plates. Molten metals are mixed together to create the final chemical composition required. This determines if the material will be steel, stainless steel, aluminium, titanium, and so on. As demonstrated in the on-screen animation, during the recrystallization process, as the molten metal solidifies, crystals are slowly formed in the internal structure. These are commonly referred to as grains. Once formed into initial workable bars or slabs, the material is then further processed and refined into usable bars or plates. This process compresses and elongates the grain in one defined direction. This is referred to as directional grain flow. During forging, the directional grain flow is compressed even further by correctly orientating and aligning the material in the forging dies to best suit the component in production. This yields a stronger and more resilient result when compared to its cast or machined counterparts. Forging is the only process that manipulates the grain flow in a way that further increases the strength characteristics of the resulting component. This is why you will always find forged components within many safety-critical industries, including civil engineering and construction, wind and nuclear power generation, rail and locomotive, petrochemical and subsea, where failure is simply not an option. If you have any inquiries or questions, don't hesitate to contact the Brooks Forgings team, who will be more than happy to help. Alternatively, visit our website at www.brooksforgings.co.uk for more information. Thank you for watching.